So you bought a new deck of cards, whether it's a Tarot cards or Lenormand cards, and now you want to know what you should do next. So there are different opinions, different methods and different mechanisms that you should do when you are receiving your deck. But in my personal opinion, you can do whatever you want. I had many teachers throughout my life and there were teachers that said you should sleep with your deck for 21 days, you should put this deck under your pillow, you should do this and you should do that and honestly you can do that if you want to. I'm not going to sleep 21 days with a deck under my pillow because first of all it's ruining the deck if you want to do that just put your deck near you i found that new decks are working with me very very well without all of these ritualistic procedures you can open the deck and you can say with your words that you are asking for this deck to give you all the accurate answers. Basically, you can say whatever you, you want and it also depends on how and through what, through what power you are working with cards. Some people are working with Christian egregores, they are praying to some saints, they are taking the power from them, they are working with those saints or something else. Some people are working with some deities, and it really depends on what are you doing. Some people are just not doing anything and they're just shuffling the deck and starting to work. So this is also can happen. It really, really depends on you and it's really individual. And I'm really not a fan of all of these gurus and teachers that are saying that you have to do something to sleep with the deck, 21 days and blah, blah, blah. I mean, I've done that and I also tried not to do that and still the cards are working very well. So basically what I will suggest for you to do is to open your new deck, go through all the cards and look at the deck. First of all, just look at the images, what they are telling to you, how they are feeling. Remember that card reading and divination with cards, it's a very, very individual process. Sometimes you will see the cards in a different way than some other person. Start to feel the images. What are you feeling when you're seeing some card? What does it say to you? Because it all depends on your life experience, of how you perceive the world. It all depends. It all depends on your mind and your internal world eventually so just look at the images pay attention to the images pay attention to the deck itself what the frequency that it's emanating to you what are you feeling with this deck then you can just know the deck better start to ask questions for your deck start to work with this Ask also questions of how we are going to work together. Just ask the deck and see what the cards are showing to you. It's something that is very private, very sacred. It's between you and your deck. So I'm not a fan of all the people who are telling you, you should do only this, you should only sleep with the deck for 21 days, or I don't know what, you should do that and this. It's all depends and it's a very very individual process and the main thing that you should do is just work with your deck that's it see how the deck is answering to you do the card of the day with the new deck that you received see how the deck is speaking with you this is really really important and of course do your usual ritualistic procedures that you are that you are used to but mainly you can just light a candle you can speak to your deck you can ask the deck to tell you all the truth that the deck will be honest with you and that you want to work with that deck and basically that's it 
also depends what is the purpose of your deck because we are buying decks for different purposes there are decks for ourselves decks for clients decks for black magic decks for something else it depends what is your purpose and what did you bought the cards for or you just like the deck and you just bought the cards just afterwards make it special to you in any way that you want so my main focus in this video is to tell you that don't be fixed don't be fixed to some gurus to some teachers i had some long experience with some teacher that told me how to read cards then i started to destroy all of that pattern that he built in my mind and i started to learn the cards by myself and i started to understand through experience my own methods so this is the main important thing that you should strive in card reading you should make your own individual rituals practices and card readings because as i said we all have different worldview we all have different life experience so basically that's it you bought a new deck do whatever you want do whatever you feel or if you're a beginner just light a candle introduce yourself speak with the deck ask the deck to tell you only the truth and only honest true and that the deck will not deceive you in any way as i said if you're working through some external egregores whether you're pagan or christian or whatever do your usual procedures so anyways thank you for watching subscribe to my channel ask me questions in the comments and see you in my next videos and goodbye